Is Snapchat still a thing? And does it work for business? I'm Terry Watkins, your chief idea catcher over at Spin Frogs, and today I'm going to share with you three things you need to know about Snapchat. Snapchat is still a thing, absolutely. And like with any social media platform, we need to identify who is using the platform and are they the people that we want in our business, in our office. When it comes to Snapchat, 71% of their users are under the age of 34 and 45% of those users are between 18 years old and 24 years old. Is this in alignment with who you're selling to? For most professional service companies like doctors, lawyers, real estate agents, insurance brokers, or home remodelers, the answer is resoundingly no. We want someone who is older, someone who is a little wiser, maybe somebody who has more disposable resources. Given the current gig economy that we live in, I would not pass up on a 20 to 24 year old because they probably have more money than we know of. So don't pass them up just because of the financial resources component, but you do wanna make sure that these are the people that you want in your facility, in your client database, before you decide to jump in and market to them on this platform. Number two, attention retention. A Snapchat story can be used to shift attention into a new blog article, a video on TikTok or YouTube, even a new post on one of your other social networks. But your audience here only sees the content for a moment, sometimes as little as three seconds, and then they're moving on to the next bit of news. So the retention and click-through rates are really, really competitive. Your content better be better than pockets on jeans to get the retention of your reviewer. So making sure that your content not only stands out and captures attention, but is something that's gonna inspire them to take that desired action. That's the catch with Snapchat. Number three, the best thing to use Snapchat for, really, is retail and restaurant industries. Why? Well, they're already regularly providing discounts on drinks and food and the like. A lot of times they have hot sales or happy hours or specials of the week. Snapchat is a great place to share coupon codes, hot sales, and those happy hour specials because they get attention, they get the clicks, they get the conversion more than anything else in the Snapchat space. Also, who goes out shopping? Who goes out drinking? Those are 18 to 24 year olds who do have some disposable income and they're looking to do something fun with their friends. So they're always looking for that discount. You know, starving college students and all, we've heard this saying before. Now, I'm not saying that Snapchat is good or bad. I am suggesting that before you dive into this social media platform, you do some analyzing on the plan for your business growth in 2022. Does this platform audience and style align with your brand values? If so, then let's build a strategy to make it effective for you. If not, let's build a strategy around social platforms that do. Get in touch with me for a free 15 minute chat today. My calendar is in the description below. I look forward to talking with you about your marketing plan.